The letter S can make different sounds. S makes the S sound at the start of words. Sip drinks in the sun on the soft sand. Sand, sell, sip, soft, sun. It also makes the S sound with S blends at the beginning of words. The skunk will smell if you stop and sniff. The swan swam swiftly with skill. Scan the plan and don't scuff or spill. Scuff, skip, smell, sniff, spill, stop, swim. Consonants may be either voiced or unvoiced. The ones on the left are voiced and this vibration can be felt with a hand on the throat. The ones on the right are unvoiced and there is no vibration. This is important to know because when an S comes after a voiced or unvoiced consonant, it can make a difference. Cats and dogs need baths with suds. S makes the S sound after unvoiced consonants. Cliffs, takes, stops, waits, paths. A cowboy puts on his boots and takes the paths to the cliffs where he stops and waits. It also makes the s sound after ending blends. Banks, pests, whisks, lumps, melts, sips. The crooks that rob the banks are pests. The cook melts butter, sifts flour, and whisks the lumps. S makes the s sound after some vowels. These flossy words end with double S after a short vowel. Pass, mess, miss, toss, fuss. Toss the pass with no fuss and no mess. Don't miss. It also makes the s sound after some vowels. Fill this bus with gas. S equals z after voiced consonants. These frogs use logs. Jobs, nods, dogs, falls, rooms, buns, stars, waves, vows, toys. Did you feel the vibration in your throat? It also can make the z sound after some vowels, like plays, bees, rise, nose, Toes, use, has, was, his, pause, eyes, lose. It is easy for boys to choose toys. Sometimes when words are made plural with an ES, an S can say is like in dishes, matches, classes, faces, horses, boxes, buzzes, noises, and judges. The faces of the foxes with wishes for the horses. So remember, when there's an unvoiced consonant, match it with the unvoiced sound, the soft sound of s. When you hear a voiced consonant, match it with the sound of z. Thank you, 
and join us at Phonics Pow to unlock the power of teaching reading.